We can find the next step of Simulacra in Paris, Las Vegas. This is a French-themed resort, including a half-scale replica of the Eiffel Tower. It is a luxury hotel that takes all the good things we associate with Paris and exaggerates them. You get to experience a world that's better than real. You're not experiencing an accurate symbol of what France is like. It's a hyper-real version, a better version. Like Disneyland's Main Street USA is a hyper-real version of small-town America. This is hyper-reality. Both are versions of something that never really existed the way it's being depicted. It's a copy whose original isn't real. Here's where some of the fallout of simulacra can be seen. There's a phenomenon called Paris Syndrome, where tourists, particularly ones from Japan, can experience extreme disappointment, anxiety, and feelings of grief and even persecution when they visit the real Paris for the first time. Because Paris, France, is a real city with all the same problems as other big cities. It's crowded, it's loud, it's dirty, it infamously smells like urine. This is so far removed from the signs and symbols we think of when we think of Paris that the shock can be very painful. Simulation doesn't just soften reality, it can overwrite it. A simulation can be louder, brighter, and more appealing than anything real to the point where it becomes more real than reality itself to those who view it.